All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Tokyo Revengers episode 15. I do not have anything saved for the start of the episode, but as always, guys, like the video if you like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this episode right now. Ooh, who is this dude? Is this the dude we saw at the final part of the last episode? Yeah. Oh, this is Takemiji's school he's walking into. Okay. Oh, God. It wasn't Akun's fault, though. You can't blame him for it. Oh, <laughs> It must be hard. I don't think Mikey would kill him over this, but it's kind of... It's a good incentive to actually get him to bring back. Yeah, I don't know what Valhalla is either. <laughs> Delinquent encyclopedia. Okay, yeah, I know that much. You didn't know that? <laughs> oh boy. Oh, so not only Kasaki came over, but 50 members from Mobius came over. That's interesting. His division. This is probably what helped with overthrow Toman. Ooh, this guy. Oh, so this is Valhalla. What? So presumably this is the group that caused all the nonsense in the future then. Oh shit, and then this guy's gonna come pull up right now. He doesn't seem too bad, I guess. I guess. Kazutora. And then this is him, isn't it? This is Kazutora. Ooh. I don't feel like he should be doing this, bro. He knows who he is. He knows him. Yeah. Yeah, Kazutora. Holy shit. Oh, he goes to the same school? Holy shit. This was not what I was expecting to happen right now. What? And they're okay with that? What the f- What is Valhalla? He seems like... He seems nice, but at the level of what he probably is, he's probably crazy strong or something. And why does he want Takemiji to go to Valhalla? Mikey gets entwined with some crazy people, I swear to god. Gotta do what you gotta do, Takemiji. Go to Valhalla. So, I wonder where Valhalla's base is then. Oh, so he hasn't been there in like two years? Oh. Okay. Ooh, who is he talking about? Who got him put in juvie? Ooh, the headless angel, yeah. The air is, like, thick with smoke. Jesus. Oh, God. Who are they beating to death here? This is Baji? And someone? Yeah, I can imagine from Tome into Valhalla. Christ. Who is this? What? He's beating his own vice captain? Oh, my God. That's fucked. This, is, this surely is like beating his best friend. Bro, tell me there's a reason for this, dude. Like, you can't be like this. And then this motherfucker's here too. Like, goddamn. That's what I'm saying. Like, Jesus Christ, how could you do that? Uh, these guys look like psychopaths. Like, gotta be honest. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. This guy is fucking big. He doesn't know why he came here. What the fuck? <laughs> Nah, that can't be the reason. What is he doing here? That's what I'm thinking. But, like, he went in on the, on his vice captain. Oh? He's going to use Takemiji as a witness? Oh, I see. Okay. Hmm. What if the... Baji is, like, a spy, but Kazutoro is all, all, also, like, a double agent? That would be cool. Oh. Okay, I don't know about that line. Oh, yeah. Kazutoro. He was the guy in the picture. Right? Yeah. Yeah. I feel like we're going to get some really interesting backstory right now. Baji, age 12. <laughs> Kazutoro, age 12, too. He's got a tattoo at 12. Oh, wait, Ken was pretty young, though, wasn't he, as well? 
Oh, Pachi in age 12 too. Mitya age 13, okay. Jack in age 13. Look at this kid. Mikey age 12. <laughs> Mikey's such a little shit. <laughs> <laughs> they got this random goddamn person in the street to take this picture. Did they have to beat him up? Really? That was the whole episode? Really? <laughs> Alright, so that was Tokyo Revengers episode 15. Uh, that episode flew by, and uh, just as we were about to explain as to why Bachi and Kazutoro are doing what they're doing right now, it ended. So that's great. Um, but yeah. Baji and what happened to his vice captain right there, that's crazy what he had to do to join uh, Valhalla. Valhalla seems very interesting, um, obviously a very cool name, and um, it seems like a dangerous kind of gang. And Kazutoro as well seems like not what I, what I was expecting him to be like, I don't know. He's obviously kind of... How he shows kind of in public is like he's very controlled, but... I reckon if you get on his bad side, it's going to be like hell. Um, regardless, though, he seems like a cool character, definitely. Uh, but it's crazy that two members, two founding members of Toman are like defecting and wanting to kill Mikey, potentially. Um, whether or not that's Baji's real plan, I don't know, but we will find out and see. But uh, yeah, that is all I really have to say, and that is that. So, anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did, and I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have an extra day, and peace out.